I had this truck my senior year in high school, and it was just during spring when uh, the snow was melting, so we decided to go off-roading a little bit. It's kind of a bad idea because my truck got stuck because the snow was melting because it was almost spring. My truck sank all the way down. I couldn't get it out. There's a school there, so they had to, like, they had to delay the, um, the end of the school day, and my pastor had to come tow my truck out of the snow. And it's just, that was probably my most embarrassing moment. So I lived on a lake my entire life, so I love the sound of boats and jet skis. I like the, the sound of nature and that's kind of contrary to the boats but like like cinnamony smells like Christmas time smells you know the pie baking and the cinnamon like holiday smells those are good I view myself as trying to make a difference through going out and and working hard to not only on campus by um, by being a part of the law and politics society on campus creating opportunities for students to get involved in public service or to learn about politics or government or law, but also um, by going out into the real world and um, working in Washington, D.C. and kind of trying to, to make my life, my life mission to, to be a public servant and to um, move forward and, and try to impact the world somehow. Um, you hear a lot of people talk about it and everyone's kind of like, what is the concept? The concept is, you know, to some people it's just a plaque, but to me, it's, it's kind of like a, a mission statement for life. It starts off and it talks about, you know, we're going to be lifelong learners and we're going to be a community of learners. But then you also go into the, the fact that as, um, you know, as Christians, we want to be dedicated to the perspective of Jesus Christ. And that doesn't mean that we're sticking our heads in the sand or anything. And that means going out and, and you work hard to change the world and make it less like what it was and more into what it could be.